to measure surface tension, we open the pendant app. The first step is to create an account with the name, password, and security question. After signing in, we must create a new project. This includes the project name, the image calibration number, which is the outside diameter of the needle used in the experiment, the differential density, which is the difference between the density of the liquid and its working environment. In this case, since it's water and air, we can leave it as the default. The acceleration due to gravity, which can be left as its default value. And depending on the unit you've ordered, either automatic injection or manual injection. We now put the phone inside the photo holder and adjust the distance from the needle. We manipulate the orange box to select the area of interest. Before adjusting the focus on the image, generate a droplet to give a reference frame. Use the focus slider to focus on the droplet. To get the best results, the focus slider must ideally be as close to the top as possible. This can be achieved by adjusting the distance between the phone and the droplet. Adjust the LED backlight and the phone's lighting to get the best possible contrast between the droplet and the background. Generate a droplet large enough so that it is sufficiently deformed by gravity. A nice teardrop shape is recommended. Generally, you need to aim for a droplet that's just about to detach from the needle. Move the orange points to the left and right of the needle, and then hit calibrate. If the calibration number is green, then the number is correct. If it is red or yellow, then something went wrong. Generally, the lower the calibration number, the better. Now, simply move the orange vertical bar to where the droplet meets the needle and the two points on both sides of the droplet and hit calculate. This will give you the surface tension, the volume, and the cross-sectional area. The app's multi-capture function can also be used to take multiple images in a set time frame. This can be used as a foolproof way of measuring the surface tension by generating the droplet slowly and taking the image right before it detaches from the needle. It can also be used to measure the dynamic surface tension of a liquid. Simply specify the number of images to be captured and the duration of the capture. Once everything is ready, hit the capture button and start generating the droplet. The calculated data can be saved in either the SD card or the cloud service of your choice. Simply select either the cloud service or SD card and hit the save button. Visit our website at dropletlab.com to learn more.